You can keep your New Year's resolutions and still enjoy delicious Mexican cuisine with lighter and healthier options. Here in our Studio 41 kitchen to break it all down is chef and owner of Guan Guana Wheat. Guana Guanajuato. Guanajuato. Oh my Guanajuato. goodness. Guanajuato. I'm thinking about it too much. Guanajuato Mexican restaurant and tequila bar, Maria Margarita Challenger. Yep. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Okay, so we've been talking about all the different ingredients that you can include in a dish that each individually have all kinds of good properties for you. One of them being cactus. cactus. Yeah. yeah, tell us about that. So cactus has a lot of fiber and a lot of people use it for um, losing weight mm -hmm. and it okay. has a lot of texture. Yeah, it is. So it's a raw cactus uh -huh. and it just you boil it with a little water. Mm -hmm. Maybe a tiny bit of vinegar because it's a little limey, but it's all part of it. Then you rinse it after and it's really good. So it's right there and there's nothing to it. There's yeah. no fat. It gives you, know, you the so texture of a meat without mm -hmm. being a meat. That's yeah, exactly. you could also grill it. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I, I see these a you lot in the stores. Yeah. 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 So we, you just cut off all of the, uh, the thorny part, the, the thorny, spiky yes. part. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So that's one of the ingredients and you can we can also, use. Uh, sorry. You can also buy it clean like that. Okay. Oh. If you want it just easier. So it's just, yeah. Because yeah, I love that. Easier to do. Yeah. Okay. I love that. Okay. So you've also got a couple proteins that you have done uh, pretty simply. Yeah. Okay. So we have chicken because for all of this we can use any kind of protein. Yeah. Even portobello mushrooms. We didn't bring all of it, but we can do a steak, chicken, shrimp. Um, Parabella mushrooms, tofu, mm -hmm. and it just make it as, you know, just you, you can fix it any way you like. And okay. it's just all very light. Okay. Yeah, right. Mexican fare really is about the seasoning, right? Well, it's about the seasoning, but it's also, don't forget, in Mexico, we walk to the market every day to do, mm -hmm. we do a lot of soups, we do ceviches, we do salads, and everything is right at the market. So really, in here, fresh. sometimes we forget, because mm -hmm. um, we do a lot of cheese and sour cream, but it's not all of that. Okay. okay. All right. Mm -hmm. So uh, tell us what you're making today. So you, you have the two meats and you're just going to show us different ways to make it and still keep it healthy. Yeah. So we have um, a watercress, um, a cactus salad Ooh. with watercress, watercress, tomato, red onions, a little queso fresco okay. and pomegranate. Okay. And then we have a bowl. We can make a bowl and it's just basically the same thing. Watercress because it's also, they have a lot of properties. They have, they're really good for you. Mm -hmm. They all antioxidants and all of that. So um, we have that and then we can put any proper, any uh, protein that we want. Mm -hmm. So here we have shrimp and then just a little paprika, garlic, olive oil, salt and pepper, yes. just to make it really simple. And the um, chicken is also just very, very simple so you can actually do it at home. Oh, but it's okay. also very tasty. We have a simple dressing. You can use any kind of dressing that you like. Okay, so but you can also make life. tacos too, right? <laughs> and we can, so a taco, I make a taco out of anything. Okay. Oh, okay. So a taco just basically if, you know, I want a salad, but I also want a little, something a little meatier. So I put the taco in there, I make a taco out of my salad, and oh. it's just, because a taco is really a, gar a tortilla with a garnish. Okay. All okay. kind of things in it. It's a okay. vehicle for, yes, yeah. for all that. Yeah. <laughs> let's so try we could, as, yeah. Yeah, let's, we're going to warm it up in here. Okay. Now so tell us so a lot about Guanajuato. So Guanajuato is my first baby. Uh, okay. <laughs> so this is called Guanajuato because it's from the city and the state that I come from, right? Central Mexico. Okay. Uh, we started in 2008, and that was my background is as a chef, and I stayed home for a long time, so then that was my first baby. Mm -hmm. We have pretty much everything for in the menu. We have vegetarian, we have vegan, we have the cheese, we have a lot of seafood, um, and just the traditionals. We're, we're traditional, but not, but a little contemporary. Oh, I like that, yeah. Mm -hmm. Place looks gorgeous. Okay, so you're warming up the tortillas. We're warming up the tortilla, and we can, if you want to assemble a bowl, yeah. or you want to assemble a salad, so mm -hmm. you can do the salad, Annie, and you can, honey, you can do the bowl. Okay. okay. We can start with the watercress, okay. and then, so, yeah, start with some water crust. Water crust. Water crust. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So bowls don't mm -hmm. always have to have rice in them. Well, no, not necessarily. But I, I would also add some black beans if you wanted to. Oh, just yeah, drain. Yeah, black be so beans good. are great. Mm -hmm. Black beans are really great for. Um, okay. So here. Okay. So, so this if is you the, do the cactus here. Mm -hmm. You put that in a bowl too? Oh, you can uh, you can actually do assemble any way you like. Why oh, don't no. we do that? So because it, it's really not there is no rules. Right. We oh, can okay. do whatever you like and then just modify oh, it and I'll do it. So down here. This okay. is just a suggestion of what we have in there. Okay. okay. But there is there is no rule. You can do you know corn, whatever you like. Yeah. And you're gonna make a taco. I'm gonna make a taco. And these Ooh, are like pumpkin this. seeds. Pumpkin seeds. Yeah. Oh yeah. So a lot good. of texture. A lot of good things on it too. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna steal some of those. Some radishes. 
still yeah, the yeah, shrimp. Yeah, you can make it really healthy. Yeah. You can make it really healthy. I love so, that. Yeah, so it's All really right. good. So if you want to check out Guanajuato Mexican Restaurant and Tequila Bar, they are on Green Bay Road in Winnetka. You can see the social media handles and the website right there as well.